This is Jim Cross of Cross and Associates. Jim, where did you go to school? Uh, I went to UCLA um, for four years and that was my full education in terms of uh, design. Um, when I was in high school I attended Chouinard Art Institute for a couple of summer sessions mm -hmm. and uh, and my dad was a commercial artist and so I used to watch him a lot and, oh, and really? uh, he and I used to paint on the weekends uh -huh. and t so I took painting when I was 10 years old so I've really had schooling all the uh -huh. way through yeah what year was that when you went to UCLA um, I was there from 52 to 56 so okay. I've been out just 30 years okay who yeah. were some of your classmates because I heard that that was a dynamite class well we had a great class uh, Keith Bright was there uh -huh. uh, Bill Tobias who's now in New York Jim Fitzgerald who inherited a lot of money and <laughs> got out of the profession uh, Don Cracky who's still here mm -hmm. in town um, I'm sure others, Gene Farnsworth, right. uh, some other guys, yeah. Sounds like a great yeah, Don guy. Cap. Right. Remember Don, sure. Yeah. Jim, how did you uh, get started in the profession? Well, uh, while I was a senior, I um, worked outside the school. I had a, a part-time job, and um, I it was with the Rand Corporation in Santa Monica. I, I started there, I think, my senior year, working 20 hours a week, and... When I graduated, I stayed with Rand. Um, I was sort of the only artist when I started out, and about three and a half years later when I left there, um, I had about a 20-man art department wow. running. Uh, they were expanding and uh, had never really understood what a design could do in, in terms of their communications. And so uh, from there, then I went on to uh, the Northrop Corporation as corporate art director. Mm -hmm. Uh, in their corporate offices here in Beverly Hills and, and um, uh, was there for about another three and a half years. Then I went to Saul Bass mm -hmm. and I was his design director for a short period mm -hmm. and uh, decided to open my own office. Uh -huh. So 